Hello everybody and welcome back to NMP and welcome back to the Turbulent Project. This is update number 7. In today's, in today's update we're going to be adding some, on, some underbrush detailing to, to the scenic board on, on board 1. So, let's swing on over to the workbench and let's get on with it. So, here we are on the workbench. Now, as you may be able to see, there has been some work which I have been doing off camera. And the work which I have done in question is adding this grass matting. Now, this grass matting um, I use is a Jarvis Scenics. It is light meadow um, and it is multi-scale. So it was perfect for this and I just happen to have it lying around as well. But what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be using the underbush, which is this, the Woodland Scenics underbush in light green. Um, this is in like a in clump material. So um, what we're going to do is we're going to be gluing it into areas where it needs specific detailing and where there's some seams, and then we are going, and then that will be the it for. Um, like the physical scenics after that we're going to be adding the background onto the back scene board and then we should be ready for filming next week so let's set up a time lapse and let's get started So, as you can see now, the flock has been added to the um, boards. And as you can see, it really has given it a really good section of detailing. Um, so, I've only used about a quarter of the jar for this one board, which is good because I can use that for other projects now. Um, the glue is going to be drying, but in the meantime, we're going to be getting the scenic background prepared. So, let's get the backboard and let's get the scenics done. So, here we have the scenic board section, which we're going to be using. Now, this is the back scene. Um, so obviously for that we have a couple of options one we could either paint it or as the option is of today's selection we're going for option two which is a printed back scene now these um i bought from hattons in liverpool so i've got these um from Hassan's, like I said, around about 14 quid, and you get two backgrounds. Um, now, it does say that these are based around Clanberis, which is in Wales, but for the sakes of this, it's going to be somewhat different. So, if we just open up the back scenes, and now these back scenes are, in fact, self-adhering, but, if I just have a look, good golly, they're massive. Okay, so one of these, should be a higher mounting range. And it's that one. Okay, so if I just... Okay, so... Let's 
put that one there, so we'll be going using that one. that over there so let's just roll this out this is evidently going to need some modifications let's put that there okay so Well, oh, these batteries are oh, massive. Okay, right. So, We just push that up. Right then. So, um, what we're going to need is pencil of some variety or a pen preferably a pencil hmm. just there and we're stopping about about here okay so with that section marked out um, what we're going to do is I'm going to actually stop the recording and I'm going to get this cut off camera as it's a bit of a, a, a laborious task and then we're going to look at getting it attached. So, I'll see you in a minute. So, now the background has actually been attached to the vaccine board and just looking at it from a distance, it actually looks pretty damn good. Um, Originally, I was going to use one with the more larger mounting scapes on it, but um, the the adhesive on it was evidently very strong, and when I was trying to stick it down, it doubled back on itself and it had ripped. So I've had to go for the lower um, Alpine, the lower mounting range, um, and personally, looking at it now. Um, I'm actually pretty proud of the work that has gone into this board. Um, it has been a good solid maybe month, two months of work into this project. 
Um, so obviously we have half term coming up, and we also have well we have we have we have a half term, and then after that we have around about six weeks until the end of the year. So um, after the half term, because I'm going to have a half term off, um, I'm ready to start doing the production itself. Now um, I hope you have enjoyed the. Um, turbulent project and the videos I've been making um, and hopefully you will tune in for the main film when it's done so once again thank you for joining me and this has been Nav of Nav's Media Productions signing off goodbye <laughs>